We've got some guests in the house today. Chris, are you introducing? Um, I'll let them introduce them. Okay. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for having us. I'm Sam Wormeyer with the Catalyst Companies. So we're happy to be here today to talk to you about uh, some production. And this is uh, Katie. I'm Katie, nice to meet you all. Nice to meet you. I'm Dustin. Happy to be here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah right? My name's Amir. I'm interviewing with you guys today. I'm super excited to be here. Um, I've actually spoke to Dave and uh, Dave. How are you doing, bud? <laughs> 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 I love you, man. So, I love you guys. I'm so so excited to work here, man. Uh, I, I love you, man. I follow you so much. Uh, <laughs> um, it's a little weird, man. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding with you, man. <laughs> but seriously, I love you too, dude. Love it. And now, what I must know is what is happening with the Cardone Global Sales Team. Sales Team! <laughs> All right, we got four deals for another six-figure day from the sales team. Deal number one for Cars Protection Plus. Let's give it up for Joe Munizaga. <laughs> Deal number two, George Miller Document Systems. Give it up for Steve Spray. Deal number three, Lone Star Storm Restoration. Let's give it up for Mike Martin. Yeah. 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 And our deal of the day for Roberto. Masato Dentistry. Let's give it up for Corey Gill. Yeah. Oh my gosh, awesome. Thank you, sales team. Great job. Great job. What's happening in real estate, Melissa? Okay, so over the weekend we had 158 new interested investors, so that brings us up to 18,250. And our new platform, our new investor management system is live on the website. So any of the um, employees that are interested, you'll get an invitation this morning to log on and register. So nice. yeah. and, and we went hard. Hard means that we went non-refundable on a security deposit, a, major, a, a, a very serious security deposit. Yeah. So uh, on our deal in Delray, which is only about 40 miles. Right, what's Delray? How far is Delray? 40 minutes. Yeah, like 40, yeah. 40 minutes, yeah. not 40 miles. So beautiful property, uh, 346 units. It's a $92 million deal, uh, 36 acres. Uh, most of the apartments that are being built right now, they're called wraps, which means they're like three or four story and they wrap around the pool. Yeah. And you don't get a lot of space, it's a lot of density. Uh, this is 36 or 31 acres? 36. 36 acres, massive piece of property in Delray, brand new. Uh, the swimming pool probably takes up three quarters, a good half acre for sure. Maybe three quarters of an acre. It's an acre, dude. It's, an acre. <laughs> it's got a movie studio in it. But they probably spent 400 grand on the movie. I mean, it's a beautiful, beautiful property. Wow. So uh, if you're up in Delray, go take a look at it. It's called Atlantic Delray. They, they're going to make me get rid of the name. Part of the deal is, look, you got to take our name off or you got to use the management company. I said, okay, I will. So the, 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 the deal is, I really want the A because it'll show up first on a search in apartments. So we're going to take the Tantalantic. <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna basically tape over T L A N T I C. It's gonna be A Del Rey. <laughs> you could just make them all A's. A. Yeah. And then all the Canadians will come. <laughs> all right, I like it. What else have you guys got today? Before we say something, talk to Chris. Let's go, man. <laughs> All right, so this is from uh, Amanda at Amy Doctors. All right, so Amanda Carberry from Amy Doctors, she's broken a, a, a personal record for herself the last two weeks after the tra training initiative of uh, you know cold calling strategies and follow up. So on average, they do about 15 to 17k a week. She did thirty thousand dollars, and last week she actually trended 20 percent higher than that on Wednesday. Wow. So very excited for her. Shout out to Amy Doctors, they're killing it over there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys, anything else? 
All right, don't you guys love working in a place where the content is so rich? You can stop on any page and you can find some golden nugget of joy. What's there, James? Let me explain simply. <laughs> Customer satisfaction does not concern me very much. Why? Because I know that we over deliver to our clients and provide customer service that is well beyond satisfactory. We over deliver to every client and we never say no until we absolutely have to. We don't even talk about customer satisfaction in my office. We do talk a lot about how to get more customers because attracting customers to our program is the only way to increase customer satisfaction. You get it? Increasing customer satisfaction is impossible without customers. Whether someone signs up for a free tip of the week or buys a book for $30, an audio program for $500, or a long-term training contract for a million, we always over-deliver what is expected. I only concern myself with getting more customers, and then I over-deliver to my clients. Nice. Woo! So, hey, you guys that are in customer service, when you're getting off the phone with somebody, ask for referrals, okay? So, uh, Todd, I want you to put a target in place for customer, what is it called? What's our customer? Client performance. Yeah, the client performance. Hey, when you're on the phone with them, hey, you, like you could start the call asking for a referral. Hey, I'm calling you for a referral today first. Okay. Then we'll talk about your shit. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> and then it'd be like, no, let's talk about my stuff first. Good. Okay, we'll talk about your stuff, and then and then go back and ask for the referral again. But you need to get a referral from these people. They're winning. They're performing. The question is, who do you know? Who do you know that that would benefit from our training? I don't know anybody. Good. Think of somebody. That's why I'm asking you. Who do you know? And you just insist, like Todd, work with them on the question and put a target in place. Let's get some referrals. Okay? Because that, that is the only way to get happy customers, to get more customers. Yeah. So if you look at Apple Computer, they, they don't, they, they're not worried about you being happy. They're worried about you having every one of their products, which will rationally, logically support you in being happy with the product. Because you'll look around and say, I got their shit everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> I must be happy. <laughs> All right, you guys ready to make some more people happy today? Yeah! All right, what day is it? Tuesday! Let's go. So look, man, you guys, you guys in management positions, executive positions, get more customers. Insist on your people getting more customers. The goal is to acquire more customers and get the customers that bought from you to buy more of your products. The people that are happiest are those that are saturated. This is a proven strategy for customer satisfaction. Those that... How you doing? Those that saturate with your products, okay? If you're selling cars, if they have three or four Hondas or three or four Fords or three or four, four Toyotas, those people are happier because they're immersed in your products. Sell them more products. That's the ultimate way to make people happy.